Hi guys, welcome back to Tech Again. This is a short video on date validation in Excel. You might have come across many situations at your workplace where you maintain a common Excel file which is used by multiple users and it's mandatory that the user enters the correct date. In this example, I have a weather report log sheet where the user is restricted to enter the weather report from of today till the seventh day in advance. So see how it's done. So here I maintain two sheets that is one is the main sheet and the next one is the data which shows the different dates. So now here I'll apply the formula equal to today close the brackets press enter this shows the today's date and then drag along sorry again use the formula plus just put plus one and drag it again so that gives you seven days in advance starting from today select all the dates create a name box by putting a text referring the selected cells i put here dates press enter so if you go here and select dates it will highlight the cells which is showing the seven dates then come back to the main sheet. Here is where you apply the date validation for that. Select the cell which you want to apply the date validation and go to the option data validation. Select the option data validation. The validation criteria, select the list option which will help you to list down the seven days and at the source click here and press the function key in the keyboard F3 that will bring you the name boxes you have and here you can see the dates which you already prepared select that one click OK and again press OK now if you go to the log date you can see a drop down option coming in and if you select that you can see the dates that is from today till the seventh day in advance so you also you can format the cell to the dates yeah And if you try to enter any other dates, say 5, 11, 17, it will prompt you an error. So this restricts the users from entering the dates properly and correctly. Hope this video helped you. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.